It does seem to be a 4-3-3, Jim. Well, one of the attacking advantages in this setup, Peter, is the impact that can be made between fullbacks and the attacking wide players. These combinations, when worked well, can be a real handful for any opposition. And we're likely to witness that again. You often see the wide man drift inside to allow the fullback to make the run out wide. And it can just throw the opposition off kilter. So it's down to business here. Gets wrestled off the ball, and he has been fouled there. Hoists it forward, tries to get it forward quickly. Plays it out to the wing. Balls out on the left now. And play for a throw. Oh, well defended, that had to be done. Just to point out, Peter, that the fullbacks are quite high. And what do they try to achieve? Well, it's obviously a move to push um, the opposition wide men back and, and give them more to think about. Has he found his man? Uh, he acknowledges that he should have come up with something better there. Uh, it was too timid to make it through the defence. It'll be noted and, and improved upon, I'm sure. Shoots! Oh, that was no routine save. Oh, that's a sparkling save. Absolutely sparkling. His reflexes were ultra sharp. Towering header. Their attempt. That's the wrong outcome. Uh, that's a little unfortunate. He had a lot of people worried then. More than happy to take the muscular approach. Can't get the better of his opposite number. He's come loose. And the shot! Great build-up. It all deserved a better ending. It's easy to say it, but difficult to stop it when runs in behind her are being made like that. And it's played forward. Well, that's where he wants it. A real chance to break. Good take, and he's had a look. Tries a shot! That's a half-decent try. Oh, that's a, an agonising miss. Just pure agonising. Great strength, too strong for his opponent. Yeah. 
Loses his balance and loses the ball. That's just very well played. He can't hurt you with his back to goal, and he didn't go for the back heel. And the finish! Oh, just lacked a decent finish. OK, it's come to nothing, but it's a warning of further threat on the break. It's got through, and... I think that's offside. Yes, it is. Keeper's got good distance on that. Looks to thread it through. Goes for goal! Oh, that is rather wayward. Oh, no, that was a chance. What a chance. Out to the right. And he's cut it out. Forward it goes. The ball has crossed the line, and it's a throw. a corner and this could be the final action of the first half and he just whacks it away has a hit oh the keeper's done ever so well well that was high class goalkeeping there to back up his, his high class wage Great leap! A decent effort as the first half draws to a close. Oh, fascinating half, full of talking points, not least that last very, very late one. So there was the first half. What an end to the half, Peter. Uh, a lot of the best action of the half coming at, at the very end, and I get the feeling the second half may well start in, in similar fashion, as we'd love to see this momentum maintained, so... I'm looking forward to what's to come. An intriguing half, lacking only in goals. The score, nil-nil. And the shot! It's there! Just the pick-me-up the whole game needs! There was to be only one outcome. Yeah, that's brilliant from him. Such a, a calm finish. Just pick your spot, don't think about what the keeper's going to do, concentrate on what you have to do. A 1-0 lead established. Well, whatever the manager said in that dressing room at half-time, it's worth the treat. was a slick move and there were several options in the box to uh, to pick out over to the left that always looked inevitable 
the defence dealt with that really well. Tries to get it forward quickly. Plays it out to the flank. Hoists it forward. Looking to break out here. It's being played forward. Jim, what are you thinking? There's a lot of football still to be played, Peter, so ideally they need to maintain a, an attacking endeavour. Oh, sweet feet. Finds himself eased off the ball. Talk about singling someone out. Yeah, now that he scored, this defence is on high alert whenever he, he goes anywhere near the ball. Oh, no, that's not the ball he wanted. Well weighted. Up he gets! And in it goes! A two-goal lead, and they're firmly in control. Oh, the cross was inch-perfect, and the header unerring. Well, look, it's, it's often the timing of the jump that dictates what you can do with any header, and if you get it slightly wrong, then you'll struggle, but that was beautifully met, it really was. So here comes the substitution. It's going to be a double change then. So that's two now without reply. That second goal has such a, a polarising effect on prospective moods. I mean, one team are under more pressure now to get the next goal, and the other will fancy their chances of turning two into three. It'll be a throw in. So now we're going to get those changes we have been expecting. made sure that that won't get through and now they can launch a counter leading by two and the finishing line in sight That'll go straight through to the keeper. Cuts it out. Come back to the keeper. Gets it upfield. Well played, he saw that coming. And it's played forward, played out to the right. He's had a goal! And that's that. A decent win by a very competent performance. Without doubt, they were the better side, and the result reflects as much. So what do you take away from it all, Jim? There's a solidity about them, almost as if they...